along the meridian beyond the edge of Eurasia is an island, the island of Sakhalin. On a planetary scale, Sakhalin is still very young. It was born as recently as 65 million years ago. Here you can still feel the pulsations of the planet's fiery core. The island dwells on giant seismic faults, where 10-point earthquakes are very often. Primeval forces of nature, tsunamis, typhoons and hurricanes rule the life. Before the beginning of time, the whole world resembled this island. Here, grasses grow to a height above the heads of humans. Pacific salmon spawn in thousands of rivers. This is the only place in the world where the endangered largest bird of prey on the earth, a relict stellar sea eagle, nests. And the Sakhalin Shelf is the world's only feeding ground of gray whales, the oldest species of baleen whales on earth. And it was here on the Sakhalin Shelf that a geological survey discovered the largest untapped oil and gas field in the world. The Sakhalin II oil and gas project was launched in the early 1990s. Three drilling platforms were erected in the Sea of Ochotsk, and 1,600 kilometers of pipeline were laid. A liquefied natural gas plant and an oil export terminal on Aniva Bay were constructed. How could all this coexist with the unique and delicate ecosystem of the island? The answer to this question demanded additional research and unique solutions of each of a thousand complex problems. To prevent oil spillage, a unique earthquake prevention system for drilling platforms was designed. Oil and gas pipelines were laid so that they could move and would not tear in case of an earth shock. Spawning rivers have remained untouched because the pipelines were laid below their beds. These rivers play an enormous role in the lives of the Nifs, the indigenous inhabitants of the island. For centuries, these people have lived according to their ancient traditions, and this could have been possible only on Sakhalin. There is one more paradox possible only on Sakhalin. The industrial development has resulted in true scientific breakthroughs. Working along the pipeline route, archaeologists have made discoveries that have changed ideas about the history of the Pacific region. Sensational facts have been revealed about the history of the Ainu, the most ancient and mysterious people of Eurasia. Today, a supermodern industrial complex spreads across the island. Development of one of the most inaccessible oil and gas fields of the world is underway. However, Sakhalin remains Sakhalin. Every summer, the salmon return to the rivers to spawn. Every spring, the sea eagles return to their nests. And in the sea, gray whales swim right up to the drilling platforms. While Sakhalin may represent the end of the earth to Europeans, to Sakhalin Islanders, it is the beginning of the world. It is the island of dawn. A young and beautiful world, like the earth before the beginning of time. <laughs>